Hello and welcome to the workshop. Thank you for stopping by. We appreciate you very, very much. As you can see, if you tune in regularly, I am not in the booth, buckets. I'm not locked and loaded on the stool. There you go. Give, give them a quick shot of it. That's where we normally do all of our sneaker review videos. Today, we're ripping and running. We're getting back to our roots, buckets. Hitting the town. You excited? How you feeling? I'm feeling pretty good. The mic's not to me, so. They're not gonna be able to hear you. The audio is not gonna be good. Like I said, ripping and running, things aren't gonna be perfect, but a lot of you have been hitting me up about the Jordan 5 Midnight Navy. We don't have a pair, so buckets. I says to the guy. I says to the guy. Me and buckets are like, hey, why not go up to a sneaker store here locally, here in the Tampa area, and see if we can grab a pair. I don't think they sold out. It's not a pair that's super sought after, even though some of you have been asking to see a review video. So uh, I think that's what we're gonna do. Buckets, am I am I leaving anything out? Am I forgetting anything? We gotta get coffee. We definitely gotta get coffee. Let's do that. Coffee first, sneaker second. Actually, since we're on the move today, we're moving around the workshop. Let me show you guys a few things. A few things. Some of you have seen these. Best workout sneaker out right now. Yes, it is the Uncivilized Sneaker, uncivilizedsneaker.com. You can cop a pair. Built to mimic the actual shape of the foot. Listen. I love Nikes and Jordans and all that stuff as much as anybody, but I'm telling you right now, your feet will thank you uh, for living in these a little bit. So uncivilizedsneaker.com, uh, we are working on a Model 2. We're working on other colorways, um, or I should say a basketball version. Uh, stay tuned. Some of you are already hip. Some of you, there you go. Uh, what else? This is something. This is, this is an archive thing right here. Buckets, I'm holding them crazy. Hang on, let me toss those down. Boom. Buckets and I were doing a custom Air Force One. We were gonna do this like a pink fur, uh, like the Cameron, pink mink, uh, the Navy for the Yankee. We were gonna do some cool stuff with these and it got shelved, but I just seen them over here and said, hey, let me show them to the people. And uh, last but not least, bam, the homie came through. Witty Beats, appreciate you, bro. Uh, local Tampa guy, he actually designed this sneaker the run the jewels, the high and the low. He designed them uh, and it's just dope. He's a long time homie, Buckets. We've known Woody for uh, 10 years, says right here, boom. 10 years of friendship, so uh, super cool. I tried to get a pair, tried to buy a pair, struck out, struck out. He surprised me the other day with a gift. So Woody, thank you. We will probably be doing a full review on these soon. Now I think that's it, man. You know Buckets, just trying to show the people, give them a little, uh, a different vibe today. Yeah. How you feeling? Are we actually out of here this time? Sure. Let's do it. So one of the cool things about this, and I've talked about it in previous videos, is the fact that a lot of Jordans and a lot of sneaker releases are not selling out the way they were a couple years ago. It's kind of nice because you can actually drive up to a local sneaker store, you can walk into a local spot and grab a pair that you want, grab a pair that you like, and a lot of you are gonna be able to relate to this. That was not always the case. Sometimes, you know, you got to jump through hoops and raffle tickets and RSVPs and, you know, or just try to cop online and there's bots and there's this and there's that. To be able to just walk into a spot, buy a pair of sneakers, there's something nice about that. There's something, buckets, what's the word I'm looking for? Old fashioned. Forget about it. Where are we getting coffee? There's only one, there's only one right answer. Yeah. It's, it's King State. One state. What is King State? You answer like Jeopardy. What is King State? We're about to show you. I'm doing a lot of uh, hand gestures today. Snaps, claps, you know, the Macarena. Nice. What are you gonna do? Pulling up to one of our favorite coffee spots of all time. King State, absolutely love it. I am a little hungry. Bucket, you hungry? I can eat. But I think I might just do coffee, we'll see. They got a little construction, a lot of construction. Tampa, a, uh, a growing 
blossoming, flourishing bosom of a city. Bosom, probably the wrong word, right? A metropolitan. A metropolitan. A, 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 a metropolis, if you will. One sip, everybody knows the rules. Is it a milkshake? Yes, it is. One sip, everybody knows the rules. Ten out of ten. Best coffee ever. Best coffee I've ever had in my life. It's right here. It's in this cup. We got the coffee, caffeinated, first and foremost. The most important thing, we're caffed up. Now it's time to get the sneakers. The mall's a little bit crowded. We found a spot. Ah, the Fred Flintstone. The 25 pound car, it's three feet long. We didn't find a spot. Goods have been acquired, uh, easy peasy. Like I said, you saw all those things on the shelf, man. Satin ones, royal reimagined. A lot of stuff that would not be sitting is now sitting. We are appreciative because we were able to grab these. We're gonna take a closer look outside. I woke up this morning. It was cold out. It was a little brisk. There was some uh, some chill in the air. There was some chill in the air. This hoodie right now got a little warm. That's Florida for you. We're used to it. Um, so this was, yeah, this was like just ripping and running, gorilla style. Hey, don't worry about it, sweetheart. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. I gotta come over here to the shadow. Come on over here. Let's get a look at them. We looked at them a little bit inside. Now we're looking at them outside. If you know, you know, this is really getting back to our roots. This is, this is the essence. This is the beginning of sneaker reviews, just like this. Boom, gorilla style. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you a few things I like about them. I like the Yankee blue. The navy, it reels me in every time. If you know, you know. I also like the fact that there's different materials. These feel, again, we're in Florida. We don't get much of a winter down here, but these feel not winterized, but a little bit more rugged for the fall and winter months. So I think that's cool. Come on, man, the Yankee blue. It's classic, it's simple. You can't go wrong with a Jordan 5, in my opinion. It's not an OG colorway. It's not some new spicy twist or anything like that. It's not a must have in my opinion, but it is a nice looking sneaker. Buckets, would you agree? Like it looks pretty good. Yeah. Would you wear these? I mean, I would definitely wear them. Scale of one to 10. You want to go first? You want me to do it? Uh, you could do it. Scale of one to 10. I'm going to give these one bite. Everybody knows the rules. What are we going to give these? Got the lace lock. Best part of the Jordan 5, hands down, the fighter jet teeth on the side. I've always said that, it's my favorite feature. I'm gonna give these a 6.7 out of 10. Very, very solid, very wearable, easy to rock. A pair that you could log a lot of miles in and really just put them on the pavement, which is nice. Uh, but nothing that's gonna blow your mind. So 6.7 out of 10 is my score. Buckets, what are you giving them? I was gonna go six. Six out of 10. So that's our range. Leave a comment below. Let us know how you feel about these. Let us know how you feel about this style video. Buckets and I were talking off camera. We may start doing videos like this more 
if you've been tuning in for a while now, you know that we used to primarily do videos like this, and then we kind of shifted to more studio vibes. So uh, let us know what sneaker you want to see. We're near the airport, so Buckets is looking up. We got airplanes in the sky. There's a lot going on. One take Drake, very little editing. And uh, that's it, man. That's a real review on the Jordan 5 Midnight Navy. 6.7 out of 10, uh, 6.35 buckets if we average the scores. And there you have it. Thank you for watching. You are very, very appreciated. We will be back very soon with a brand new video for your head top. I got nothing else, buckets. Anything from you? Nope. Hiya! Hey